Thank you. Magandang hapon po sa inyo lahat. Ako po si Faye Dominic Davesa, representing Quezon Province. Opo, hininga mo ka pag akit ng stairs. Yes. Okay na po. So, 30 seconds lang. Okay po. Yes. Tell us something about it. Tell me, uh, ako, when I was born, tinatawag nila, uh, nung nakita ko ni mami ko, sabi niya, ay, parang napalitan yung anak ko. Kasi po, may itim ako nung bata pa ako. <laughs> Pero, yung lolo ko nagtiwala sa akin. First, yung nakita po niya ako, sabi niya sa akin, ay, gaganda pa yan. So, sobrang positive na lolo ko. Kaya naman, no seventh birthday, ang request niya po sa akin, ang wish niya sa akin, sabi niya, ate, gusto ko sumali ka na Miss Universe Philippines. And that's why I am here. I am... Time. Ay, tapos na yun? <laughs> Wait lang po, may sasabihin pa ako. Ay, Ay ganun lang pala kabilis. Oh, oh sorry. Hindi ko pala aning ending ko. <laughs> okay. What is one beautiful word in your language, which is Tagalog? And what does it mean? Kalikasan. Our Mother Nature provides us all with so many wonderful and useful things that we could ever imagine, from beautiful sights to food and shelter, and these are all vital for living. Thus, I would like to encourage everyone to take care of our natural resources for the sake of our children and for our future. We must do more to combat all aggravating factors that threaten our Mother Nature. After all, our planet can live even without us human, but we, we cannot live without our planet. Hi. Sakto. Ay, by the way, ang ganda po ng bamboo, bamboo ba tumbler. Yes. Gift ko po sa mami ko yung bamboo tumbler bago ako pumunta dito. Mm -mm. And birthday niya kahapon. <laughs> yes. And she loves the environment like me. That's why I'm wearing green because it's color of life, it's color of freshness and beauty. <laughs> color do you think symbolizes the phenomenon warmth? Chartreuse. Green na lang. <laughs> Green na lang. <laughs> it's a very uh, hard color to pull off, but I think uh, with the right level of confidence, I can do it. Hi, may adlaw sa tanan. <laughs> I'm Ariel Joyce Pasqua. You can also call me MJ. I'm 27 years old. I'm representing the Tuna capital of the Philippines, General Santa City. So I'm also a graduate of AB Mass Communication in the premier university of General Santa City. I, I resided in, I'm residing in General Santa City, and, but I, I reside in General Santa City, but sorry. I'm thirty seconds. I'm thirty seconds. No, gulat ako. What is one beautiful word in your local language, and what does it mean? That's kalino. It means tranquility. Because I think in this time of pandemic, we all need tranquility and happiness. I am, they say that I am the life of the party and I make people happy and brighten up the world. So I think if you have a party, you can always invite me. <laughs> what is Kalino, it means tranquility. It's in Bisaya. Okay, next question. What is that one learning experience that you have as a child that means so much impact on you? I mean, the courage that my mom she battled cancer, lung cancer, for almost nine years. And in this time of pandemic, uh, it is really hard for me because aviation industry is one of the most affected industry in this time of pandemic. And working as a flight attendant for almost four years, and I lost this job. I lost my dream job, but it made me so stronger to achieve more in life and focus more on Winning the crown of Miss Universe. Speaking of the pandemic, what is the most important lesson you've learned during the pandemic? The have an attitude of gratitude. We all have that 
time in this pandemic that we are so much, a lot of battles that is happening in our mind. I suffered a lot of depression because of the work, but I should have that attitude of gratitude to be more thankful for what is happening, for what I have right now. I have time with more time with my family, my health. I'm negative Sorry. and. I'm <laughs> Time. If you win, how will you help your community? I'm so passionate with the youth and our generation. So I made a movement of Next is Me. I've been so so happy to involve in our community, in General Santa City, to help the indigenous uh, communities. I also have programs like Pro Proyecto Cuaderno. It's a Proyecto Calon program that we made with Eliza and with my sisters here in Miss Universe Philippines because we want to continue. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone. Yes. Okay. So 30 seconds lang. Wait. <laughs> <laughs> Kailangan kong huminga. Kailangan kong huminga. Okay. Game. Game na. Game na. Game ka na ba? Sa Sa Actually, pa ulit ulit. Feeling ko pa ulit ulit kami na sinasabi na malamig. Ayon. Tapat ng bina ba namin yung shawl? Hindi na to yan. Hindi na to yan. Natural na malamig, hindi yung aircon malamig. Ah ah. Pinapapatay ko yung aircon kanina. Wala palang aircon. Sabi ko, pakipatay yung aircon. So, wala pala. Sige, ang dami kong chika. So, tell us something about you. So, I'm Alexandra. You can call me Alex. I'm 26. I God, it's cold. I'm from Sampaloc, Manila, actually. So, kaya supernatural ko lang. Kasi, basically, ganito talaga kami sa Manila. Like, super, hindi kami super, um nag fake ng personality namin kung paano kami mag-dress up. Kaya minsan, most of the time, lagi lang ako nakapajamas. And then yesterday, I'm wearing a sweatshirt, not like this. And then super, mas comfortable ako Sorry. without makeup. Thank you so much. Huwag <laughs> ka, huwag, nag-easy ka lang sa pag-time. Or nag-gugulat ako eh. Parang may galit ka yata, sir. <laughs> Uh, Gulat ako. Manila, Tagalog to. So, what is one beautiful word in your local, uh, in your language, and what does it mean? I'm sorry, one, what is? One beautiful word in your language, and what does it mean? One beautiful word in my language. Well, Manila, usually Tagalog lang naman. So, um, ano? Yung mahapag-isip, wait. <laughs> wait lang, pwedeng pakipos yung time. Anyway. <laughs> Okay, um, for Manila, I would go for matatapang. Matatapang lahat ng manilenyo, manilenya, kahit babae matatapang, meron silang pinaglalaban. Especially, alam namin, tama yung, pinag, tama yung pinaglalaban namin. Lagi kami nasa tama. Kasi, it's super nonsense naman kung... Easy lang, direct. Easy ka lang, direct. Huwag ka magalit sa akin, direct. Ako lang to, direct. <laughs> question. What is that uh, learning experience that you had as a child? That made so much impact on So, growing up as a child, syempre naging daddy's girl ako, meron siyang future na gusto for me, and then parang ako, wait lang ha, super chill na lang ako nang tayo, and then parang ako syempre parang iniisip ko super limited ng resources ko, and then growing up, narealize ko na nagawa ko siya all by myself. So, so basically, I'm inspiring every dreamers out there kasi I was once a dreamer. Na parang ayaw akong isipin nila na mayroong hindrance or whatever. Eh, nakasmile na si Derek. Okay. <laughs> Next question. What about in this pandemic? What is the greatest lesson you need? In this? A pandemic. During this pandemic. So during this pandemic, sobrang negative na nakasin ang nangyayari eh. So I try to stay positive. Ayaw ko munang mag-isip na to social media sobrang dami kasing fake news sa parang 
lahat na lang ng tao mayroong gustong sabihin ng negative. Bakit kailangan lagi na lang negative yung kinakalat niyo? Super negative na nangyayari. Let's just got to chill. Ano, wala namang mawawala kung magpaka-positive tayo. It's super good nga eh, kasi you're making everyone around you super happy and chill as well. Yan. Hindi wow. ako nag-time. <laughs> <laughs>